TFNN. Headline news update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials right now up 171. You get the NASDAQ up 49. S&Ps are up 13. If we go over to the NDX 100, we take a look at the NDX. What you're looking at inside the NDX as well as the NASDAQ composite, folks, they want to go up and test their highs. We're at 71.42 inside the NDX. 71.86 is that high. Inside the composite, we take a look at the composite. Composite uh, right now is trading up 48 bucks. You're at 76.02. 76.37 is the number. So the way these are trading. It looks like we're going to hit both of these uh, numbers more than likely tomorrow. Um, S&P. S&P right now is uh, up by 13 uh at 27.46, we have the gold contract down $2.80, 12.9650. Gold continues to struggle. Uh, bottom line has to get back inside the 1,315 area to be in the higher range. It has continued to reject lower price, but bottom line, you need a sign of strength. Silver, silver's trading $16.42. We get the light sweet crude market uh, basically getting back inside a lower range. Uh, right now, you're trading down 96 cents. You're trading at 65.85, and that does does open up but basically a $60 range. Notes and bonds. We get the 10 year note down 11 ticks, 119.26. 30 year bond down 23, 144.03. If we do go over and take a look at them, what you're going to see is that the notes and bonds are right back to where the strength was, where they started from. A little above it actually, but 10 year 119.21. Uh, we are down there today with uh, 597,000 contracts. Now, that's anemic contract volume as we're coming into that strength. King dollar. What do we have with king dollar? King dollar comes down today. Uh, 184 ticks. It has light volume on this pullback. We're only at uh, 16,000 contracts right now. Uh, you hit 93.630. It looks like King Dollar once again has rejected lower price. Uh, bottom line, in order for King Dollar to basically get in a lower range, we'd have to close under 93.480. I don't see that happening today. And the way that uh, we had come down with lighter volume, it looks like good old King Dollar wants to bounce once again. Uh, volume out here is anemic. There's no two ways about that. You get summer trading. Mondays and Fridays in the summer. Right now, you're at 426 million inside the NYSE. That'll say the NYSE will do about uh, 750. If we take a look at the NASDAQ composite, which is going after highs, you're at 1.5 billion. That's not bad. You're going to get that 2.2 billion. Stay right there, folks. Coming back with the last 60 minutes of trading. Dow Industrials up 170, NASDAQ up 48, SP's up 13. We're going to be coming right back.